how to identify witches in your dream. Great delight in my heart tonight. I want to welcome you to this week. Wonderful program of yours, your dreams and interpretation with me, Paul S. Joshua. Trusting God that today, God is going to speak to us again from our dreams. All right. I'm sure we're having a fantastic encounter in our dreams and we're curious to know what God has for us. So today I want to share with us something very interesting that uh, how can I know witches in my dream or how, how can I know dreams that points to witches and all of that in my dream. I'm going to share that with you. But before I go on, I'd like you to quickly uh, listen to these two scriptures I want to read because they're important to some of the points I'm going to be sharing with you. Nahum 3 verse 4 says, all because of the many hallowed trees of the hallowed, the charming one, the mistress of sorceries, the mistress of sorceries who sells nation by her hallowed tree and families by her sorceries. Now take notice, all because of many hallowed trees of the hallowed and charm, the charming one, the mistress of sorceries who sells nation by her hallowed tree and families by her sorceries. Now look at the connection between hallowed tree and sorcery. There's a connection between hallowed tree and sorcery. Don't forget that. Now, Revelation 9.21 says also, And they did not repent of their mother, nor of their sorceries, nor of their immorality, nor of their theft. Now, look at the connection with sorceries in Revelation 9.21. And they did not repent of their mother, mothers, or of their sorcery, nor of their immorality, nor of their theft. Now, sorcery is connected here to mother. Sorcery is connected here to immorality. Sorcery is connected here to theft. Now, God can be showing you somebody that is dangerous after your life, a witch or with that, in your dreams. And you need to know the dreams that shows you that there is a witch around me. Number one, anyone who stares at you angrily in the dream. If you notice in the dream, that someone is staring angrily at you constantly in your dream. I mean, seeing so, a particular person from time to time staring at you angrily in the dream. You need to be careful. If that dream is persistent, then you need to begin to watch out for such a person. Begin to mark or cycle such person. Anybody you see in your dream constantly staring furiously at you. Furiously at you in the dream, staring at you angrily from time to time. You see that dream, not once, not twice. The same person appearing in your dream, looking at you furiously, staring at you angrily. The person can be destructive. That is why Holy Spirit can be bringing such person to you in your dream so you can take notice. Number two, when you see somebody in the dream who sleeps forcefully with you, anyone, anyone who want to sleep forcefully with you, I mean mix love or sex with you in the dream forcefully. Anyone that keep coming in your dream that wants to make love to you forcefully, that wants to sleep with you in your dream, that want to have sex or intercourse with you in the dream, you need to also note that that person can be a witch. Because you can see the connection from the scripture I read between allotry and sorceries. Who sell the families by sorceries and by allotry. Now, harlotry and sorcery are interwoven. They are connected. So anybody who is a sorcerer, who is a witch, will always appear in your dream that I want to make love to you, want to sleep with you, want to have sex with you. This is one of the ways that witches can operate in your dream world. They try to have sex with you so they can take your power, so they can establish a covenant with you. And that is why anybody that frequently appear in your dream to make love, to sleep with you, to have sex with you, can be seen as a witch. And number three, anyone who stab or want to stab you in the dream, anyone who appears in your dream wants to stab you or stab you in the dream can also be called a witch, can be seen as witch. So if you're having a dream and you constantly see somebody with knife stabbing you in the dream or trying to stab you in the dream, then you need to cycle that person in real life. Cycle the person. God might be showing you a witch around you. God might be showing you a sorcerer or a sorceress around you. Somebody carrying the spirit of sorcery. Now, these are the kind of people that appear in your dream and want you dead. They want to stab you. Did you ever have dream somebody stab you? If you have the dream one, two, three times, you pray again and you still see the same thing, then God won't be showing you that person for nothing. 
it must be that the person is out to destroy something in you number four anyone who steals treasure in your dream anyone who steals treasure from you in the dream can also be seen as witchcraft can be seen as a witch for example somebody appear in your dream and take away your wedding ring somebody appear in your dream and take away your bag somebody appear in your dream and take something very important anything that is treasure anything that is treasure remember where i read in revelation 9 21 revelation 9 21 or is it 9 21 yeah you will see a connection between sorcery and theft see what the bible said revelation 9 21 and they did not repent of their mothers nor of their sorcery nor immorality nor of their theft so sorcery immorality sorcery and theft has connection sorcery and theft stealing has connection so if you see somebody stealing from you in the dream somebody appearing in your dream and stealing something or attempting to steal something from you you see the person from time to time in your dream then you need to be careful with that individual because god might be showing you a witch around you in the dream god might be telling you be careful with this person this person is dangerous this person is deadly this person can deal with you this person can kill you this person can steal any treasurable thing from you so anyone that appear in your dream and steal treasure or wants to steal treasure from you can also be seen as a witch the next one you see is anyone who stones you anybody who stones you or chase you in the dream can also depict witchcraft see anybody that stones you regularly stones you in the dream not once not twice i'm talking about dream that manifests up to three above three times above somebody appearing in your dream and stoning you chasing you i mean that person can depict witchcraft so you have to be very careful whoever is stoning you in the dream or trying to chase you chase you dangerously in the dream you have to be careful God won't just open your eyes to show you that for nothing. Now, the next one, number six. Anyone who shows up as snake in your dream. Anybody who shows up as snake or throws snake to you in the dream. There are times some people share dreams with me. that They see somebody in the dream and suddenly the person changed to snake. I mean, seeing somebody appearing in your dream and either throwing snake to you or you see somebody in your dream and then you see snake around the person. God can be showing you a witch. God can be revealing somebody carrying the spirit of witchcraft to you so you have to be very careful okay the next one i'll share before we go on is anyone who you notice in the dream like to suffer you anybody who suffers you in the dream you see sometimes somebody in the dream trying to suffer you maybe trying to beat you or trying to do something to hurt you badly and you frequently see that person in your dream trying to suffer you you know sometimes you see some people in, in, in the dream where something bad is happening to you so the person will be smiling and be happy I mean, if you have had that kind of dream, a lot of you share that dream, those kind of dream with me. Somebody will stand by you. Maybe you are in a war zone, in a battlefield, and the person will be smiling and be laughing while you are going through tough time. Or maybe sometimes the person is even uh, directing enemies your way so they can attack you, they can hurt you, they can suffer you. And this is somebody in real life you really love or you trust. And you can see the person in the dream trying to organize or just straight harm towards you to suffer you and you are having that dream repeatedly repeatedly then you need to be careful with such individual so this is how you can recognize uh, witchcraft or witches in your dream so take notice